Aloha, this is Batens Kalorio Kalani, and this is In the Book Review, and this is Surfer Magazine. As you see, Surfer Magazine, how's this shot of me behind? You see, the shot right here. It's me with the one eye, the one eye fro. My friend Stretch gave me that board. Sick, yeah? How's the arbor? Harley, dude. Okay, here we go. It's our first Surfer Magazine report. Take one, 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 just one. And look, this book is pretty sick because you know why? Dude, there's waves in the Sierra Desert. Gnarly. Gnarly Sahara Desert. And dude, I got some interesting things I need to say about Surfer Magazine. Surfer Magazine has been always good to me. and Good for the surfers. Okay, you ready? Here we go. Can you see me? Am I too dark? Because I am. Okay, let's go. Okay, one well, of our first reviews is, of course, one of my favorite surfers. And he's like a nephew to me. And it is, bam! Kalani Chapman, it's my boy. Bugger rip, cause, okay. Okay, as we go along, we're going along, moving along here. Surfer Magazine. One of my other favorite surfers. Of course, Bruce Irons, gnarly dude, brother Bruce, you rip, cuz, you rip, okay, let's see what else we got here, but of course, we cannot forget, girls who rip, there's a girl ripper, it's a Roxy ad, but it's okay, we're just looking at the girl surfers, we're not doing no ad thing, this is all about surfers. Cool. Chicks who rip. Dude, gnarly, bro. That's Alyssa. Oh, it's Carissa. I know Carissa. Okay, as we move along, we got one. Oh, one of my favorite, favorite nephews who rips. Brother Nathan Fletcher, bro. Nathan, you rule, dude. You rule. Thanks for my fortune. Oh, I really appreciate that. It rips. Okay. Got a neat. Okay. What else we got here? Oh, I got a good one. How's this? Groms who rip. Yeah. Prop to the Groms. Groms who rip, bro. Keep up the ripping, Groms. Practice, practice, practice. Groms who rip. Another Grom. Another Grom who rips. It yeah, look. Groms who terrorize. Okay, we're moving along. Let's see what I got. See, I got these all I have all these tagged. Okay. Look at this one. Boo, how's this? Buttons Jr. with the fro. See him. <laughs> Sick, huh? Right there. Buttons Jr. with the where is he? Hey, where'd he go? Oh, there he is. Hold on. There we go. See the fro? Dude, I had a fro like that. I still can't have a fro, but see, my hair is kind of short right now. It's going to grow out. Okay. Next. This is pretty interesting. Dude, we have surf everywhere around the road. Hot, cold, but dude, this is gnarly. How's this? Canada. Dude, check it out. Dude, snowing on the beach, bro. Jesus, that's gnarly, bro. See, people surf all over the world. That's cool. All over. North Pole, South Pole, you name it, we're there. Surfers brew all over the world. That's a good thing. Okay, moving along. Buttons in the news for surfers. Look at this guy wearing an Eskimo jacket. And dude, the wind is gnarly. Dude, surfers who surf in the cold room. I don't know about me. I don't think I could handle the cold. You know, it's just too cold. I live in Hawaii. I'll just stay here and just rip here. Look at this one. The guy's pulling in, bro. Freaking 20 below. Gnarly. 
Okay. Okay, there's an interesting one. Okay, where am I? Oh, here we go. Dude. How's this? Dude. They got snakes, camels, and they got perfect barrels. Sick barrels. You see that? You see that guy pulling in? They see him. Damn. It's in the Sahara Desert, but the water is cold there. You guys are wearing full land wetsuits. Dude, how's this one? <laughs> how's that picture right here? Taliban surfers. No, just kidding. But hey, there we go. Look, you see him? You see the guy? Ta Taliban surfer. Cool, even the Taliban. Or the people who live in Sahara would live on camels. I ride camels, they surf too. Props to the camel riders. Dude, gnarly. How's this saying? We saw our first camel and ate our first camel all in the same day. Ew, gross. But you gotta eat, you know what I mean? Whatever is there to eat, you eat. If it's food, you gotta eat, you gotta eat. So I look at it. You hungry, you eat. Okay. Here we go. This one kind of caught my eye. This one really caught my eye. Okay. This is about, this is important to me because I have a shaper by the name of Nelson Sodoy, a bunch of shapers, Vicelli, all my all the guys that shape boards for me. We were talking today about shaping. And it turns out that, well, let's see, that China is making surfboards and manufacturing surfboards that to me is not good because of the fact that it takes away it takes away to me is the mana from shaping for the shapers that shape hand shirt shape boards and then taking it to another level by taking it to China I think it's not really that great but you know uh, I mean just from what I hear lately, the shapers that shape my boards and stuff saying that because China's making mass production surfboards and taking away the market from the local boys, the local shapers, which I think is not fair because I mean that's how they eat, man. That's their bread and butter. So um, I was kind of upset about this. You know, uh, look at this. I want to show you something that kind of caught my eye that I didn't like. Dude, listen to this. Only those boards, only, well, anyway, listen, I don't like this. Okay, look, it says here, if you can read it, it's not cool. So we give our shapers a chance to shape. Anyway, this is buttons in the news, in on surfers, surfers who rule, dude. Aloha. Kani Allah.